Hello guys, Igor here doing one more Epsomo review. Today analyzing Poda, a tool that now has an exclusive deal on Epsomo and it's a project management tool that will mix the features of the mind mapping with project planning. It is less expensive on Plus, so if you have a Plus subscription, you can buy it less expensive, but also you can buy it if you don't have Plus. The deal is pretty simple to understand. You get all the features of the exclusive plan and it has unlimited everything. So it's pretty good. One workspace, unlimited everything, and you can buy more codes to get more workspace. I'm gonna show you now how the tool works. You can see here, Poda, on your project settings, you can invite guests. Just click here, enter their email, and you can select the role. If they will be able to add the workspace boards, if they would be able to comment or only to fill those boards. Here on up left, you can create a new workspace. Remembering with one code, you get all features and unlimited for one workspace if you want to have more than one. So you need to buy more codes. On the workspace, you can add the logo. You can change the name of the workspace. And also you can change the node types and status. Here is a project. And on the project, you can see that you have the tree view. That's the mind mapping. The roadmap view and the settings. Okay, so that's the mix between road uh, roadmap, uh, so project management, and the mind mapping. So let's see here. We have our first node, and on node you can change the type. Remember, you can add any uh, icon or even text to those types. If it's an idea, it's a goal, step, task, etc. Clicking here, you add a new property that you can, you know, say for instance, that property is related to A. And then here you can add the kind of feature. Collaborators, clicking here, you can add the person you want to add. The proper type is to add person, mode, select, or only select between different tags okay and like notion it's pretty uh, similar than notion like notion if you want to add a new tag that will be the status you just add here on feature here and you create your status pm okay on that property here if you want to delete the property just come here and delete the property you can also add child nodes then you can like notion opening different Paid on a same node. So child node uh, right here, save. And you can see here, child node, you're gonna add a new page just like Notion. And here you can see your activity and also leave a comment. It will show up like that. Hi. Okay, here is a comment. And you can see that I added a new node and I have a new feature here on my mind mapping. If I want to add new nodes, just just can click here and I can select between go idea step or task. I write here. Look, a new node is just here. If I want to add two main nodes, I just click here and I keep going, creating my mind map. See how it's simple to create a, a mind map with multiple steps. Just click on it and it's done. You can zoom in and also zoom out. Here on the roadmap, everything will be organized. And so if you want to change here to next or to now, it will show up like that. And it will not make any, sh any change on your mind mapping. Your mind map is still working on the status here on now and the status here on later. So you can change everything here on the roadmap. On settings, you can add the guests, as I said, and uh, 
change you can change the project meter per for your project so it's pretty cool as you can see pretty easy to understand how the tool works you have the possibility here to share the link with anyone or also select who can view your project okay so anyone with a link would be able to see the project you can connect slack as integration and here is Pura. i hope you like that review i added the link on the description so you can take a look at the deal and see if it works for you thank you so much bye bye